You are watching a master at work. What's going on, friends? If you're in the market for a big, low-cost 3D printer, the Eligu Neptune 3 Max has you covered. With a 420 by 420 by 500 millimeter bed size, this thing is an absolute monster. And I've got to tell you right now, this thing is no slouch. At only $470 for this size printer is actually a pretty damn good deal. Now, working with this printer so far, I've not actually found any negatives with it at all. In fact, one of the only things that I would suggest you do is probably change out that 0.4 nozzle for something bigger, a 0.8 or even a 1 mil. Now, this large bin was actually printed in vase mode, and it took a mere 16 hours and 38 minutes to print. And the secret to this is using a 1.4 millimeter nozzle. The nozzle in question in this case is the Bontec CHT nozzle. So thank you very much to Bontec for supplying me with such an excellent nozzle. Yes. So I have had this printer for the last couple of weeks. So let's take a deep dive into some of the features. Today's video, by the way, is sponsored by PCBWay.com. Who are PCBWay? Let me tell you. Attention all makers, hobbyists, and 3D printing enthusiasts. Want to bring your ideas to life? Look no further than PCBWay.com. With their top-notch quality and unbeatable prices, they make circuit board production a breeze. Plus, with their online 3D rendering service, you can visualize your designs before you bring it to life. So why wait? Visit PCBWay.com today and start creating. The LEG Neptune 3 Max is a fantastic large-scale FDM printer with several impressive features. Firstly, a massive print volume. 420 by 420 by 500 mil, it cannot be underestimated. It gives you ample space to unleash your creativity. Whether you want to print larger models or print in batches, this printer can handle it all. The dual gear direct drive extruder provides smooth and accurate filament feeding, reducing nozzle clogging and gear jumping. This is a great feature for anybody wanting to print in a multitude of filaments including PLA, PETG, ABS or flexibles like TPU. The auto bed leveling at 53 points and auxiliary leveling ensure that each print is consistent and even, which means there's no more worrying about uneven prints. The Z-axis is designed with dual lead screws and dual motor drives, making it stable and precise, and the double tie rod structure adds to the overall stability of the printer. This means your print will come out looking great, without wobble or deformities. One thing I was most pleased about is the STM32-bit silent motherboard, so printing noise is definitely kept to a minimum of below 50 decibels. This is great for those who do not wish to be disturbed by loud printing noises. The giant PEI magnetic platform is both strong and anti-warping, and the removable touchscreen allows for easy operation and preview of the print model. The touchscreen can also be handheld or fixed to the base, and the printer also comes with a draw box for storing tools and accessories. All in all, the LEGU Neptune 3 Max is a great choice for anyone looking for high quality and feature-packed 3D printing. I would highly recommend this printer to anyone that wants to take their 3D printing to the next level. Personally, I feel that this printer isn't trying to be something that it's really not. It's a practical, well-priced bed slinger, and certainly a printer that I will continue to use. So the assembly only took 20 minutes, and if you have a look on the SD card, there is even an assembly video, so I won't cover that. But rest assured, it's easy. The box is huge, and there'll be no hiding that from your partner. That, of course, is not the end of the story, and up until now, I have been very happy with the AnyCubic Cobra Max. That printer is a little bit smaller and more expensive, so I think it's worth looking at why the Eligu offer is such a steal. Price and build area is going to be key, and pretty much all of these Cartesian printers of this kind of size share workable elements such as V-slot wheels and Z-rods. So again, the key area is the price and the build volume with 400, 400 by 450 and a $529 price tag. This is a glass bed, not a PEI sheet, and it's also a Bowden setup. Next up, we have the Creality CR6 Max. This printer is a 400 by 400 by 400 general Cartesian printer, again with a Bowden setup with a price coming in at £782.10. This is a printer that is a few years old now, but it might be something that you wish to consider. The Eligu for the money, size and quality is the best value printer for this size and range. We do have the Creality CRM4 in the works, but again, the crossover between good budget and prosumer with a price range to match, as that printer will be retailing just a snot under $1,100. However, in all honesty, if you're thinking of any other printer for the price, really, Eligu has it nailed. If the Max feels a little bit big for your printing needs, the Neptune 3 range comes in in the form of other two smaller printers, with the only key differences being the bed size and the price. Perhaps the Pro or the Plus would be more fitting. Let me know what you think about these printers in the comments below. So over the past two weeks, I have printed quite a few things now on the Neptune 3 Max, including these huge bins. I didn't just stop with one. I thought we'd make a multitude of these things, in fact. And I've just moved on to doing the Darth Vader helmet. So make sure you check out my social media to see how these things turn out. 
So on social media this week, there was a question around ringing, and you can certainly see on some of the smaller models, there is, well, a small amount of ringing. On the larger prints, though, there doesn't seem to be any noticeable ringing whatsoever. In fact, Marlin put out a new command for input shaping in their latest version of the firmware. What I'll do is I'll link below to TH3D, who have got a page dedicated to how input shaping works in Marlin. So check out the TH3D input shaping calculation tool. I'll link those guys down below. I want to thank a few people. First of all, PCB Wave for sponsoring the video. Bontech for sending me their CHT nozzle range. Eligu, of course, for sending me this fabulous printer. And of course, you guys, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe button. And we will see you next time. Thank you for watching. You are watching a master at work.